Guys, I want to do a quick review and just let you know about this uh, 2022 Ford Mustang EcoBoost. Um, this one has the performance package on it, so it's it's pretty awesome and fast. You can see it's got those black rims on there with the Mustang emblem. It's really nice, um, and I like I love when they do this too when they put the the, uh, the black on the mirrors, so it's a different color than the rest of the car, and the black on the roof. You can see this one's got some rain on it but I think it looks super nice. And then you've got that little black spoiler, just the tiniest spoiler, and it looks so nice. Um, so this one uh, also in particular has, let's see, let's put it over here. So it's got the remote start, which is pretty cool too. Um, one awesome thing too about this is um, it's got the, the keyless, uh, just like proximity entry. So you just go put your hand on it. As long as you have the keys in your pocket, you're, um, you're good. So it's nice because you don't ever have to take them out. So um, I love the, the Mustang headlights. This is what the front of it looks like too. They got that blacked out emblem on there as well. Um, and that like honeycomb grill. I like that they've got that skirt on there as well. So let's see, let's go in real quick. Just look at what it looks like on the inside. So this one has, this has cloth de seats with the white stitching. You can see here, and it says Mustang on there. I think I would add some catskin leather seats to this. You got that handle strap right here that you can button on or not. Um, back seat's pretty small, as you can see, just for two people, and there's like hardly even any room, so it's more like for little kids. Um, but, so that's the, uh, the back seat. Then you can see if we get in here. So the the front seat, the driver's seat is passing is uh, powered. Oh, it's got that Mustang. It's upside down right here, but from this angle, um, you can see. So it's got a push button ignition, which again you don't have to take the keys out of your pocket. So that's super nice. Then it's got the Sync Three um, wireless, I believe, uh, wireless. Android Auto and Apple CarPlay, and uh, I love the different toggle switches down there, plus the 10-speed automatic transmission, which I think is awesome. Two small cup, cup holders here. Um, got that, I believe that's, yep, that's an automatic uh, dimming uh, rear view mirror, uh, which is pretty sweet. Those light switches up there, and then the emergency brake, and you've got this, again, not huge, little um you got this little center console um holder the one thing so you'll notice there there's the usb and then there's another usb up there then you have this over here as well the one thing i don't like about this is that there's no usb c um other than that i think it's like an awesome, awesome car. I just drove it. This is the EcoBoost, and it's so nice. This is what the steering wheel looks like as well. So you can see the the different controls on there. I just, I, don't, I really like the way Ford does things. But um, anyway, and then up here, you can see, we'll actually start this, we can turn this. So that's what it looks like up there. Okay, okay. Shows you the tire pressure right there everything you can go through all these different things as well you got your both your gauges up there so yeah a few vents um i love this i think that looks so nice um i don't think it's super high i don't know if it's super high quality or not but i think it looks really really awesome so i'm a huge fan i'm a huge fan of this um i love this over here as well so I got that leather over there and the, the stitching. So I'm curious if you were to add your own custom leather to this, what color would you get? Would you get black? Would you get um, brown, like a peanut butter brown? Or would you get, you know, and if you did, would you get like white stitching or what? What would, what would you guys do? Let me know in the comments.